Oh, really? It didn't. Obviously, it didn't because I was interrupted. Uh, but I got I, the point across, all right. I see. Um, I'll be darned. Uh, first time caller line. You're on the air with Father Malachi Martin. Where are you, please? Hi, I am in Colorado. Colorado, okay, uh -huh. ma'am. Hi. Um, first of all, I just want to say, uh, Father Martin, I just you are very much a man with the spirit of God in you. I just cannot believe I, this is the first time I've ever heard you, and this is just it's just wonderful listening to you. Thank you, ma'am, really very is. much. Oh well, you're very welcome. My God, um, I just have a question about Satan worship. Yes. Um, well, this might sound kind of personal for me, but I think it might apply to a lot of other people out there that might be listening. Yes. Yes. Um, about six years ago, my sister and I started having memories of things that had happened to us when we were small children. Mm -hmm. We remember going out in the desert. My parents took us there. Yes. And it was out in the Mojave. Uh -huh. And there was like a ceremony with this leader. And I don't remember too much because I don't let myself remember. Uh -huh. But yeah. What age were you? I was eight. So and she was probably six. Was there the use of fire? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Now that you bring it up. <laughs> uh, and what? Now that you bring it up, yeah. Yes. And was there any use of bones? Oh, I don't remember that, no. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. But we both remember specific details exactly, you know. Both of us remember the same thing. Remember a baby being killed. Yeah. And a woman upholding the baby. Yeah. And... That was this. This is was Satanist. There's no doubt about that. Usually, what they do is they they either eat or, or pardon my language, it's repulsive to our minds. Um, anyway, they eventually arrived at having the baby's bones, and they use that to make a certain type of not music, but a certain type of sound, which they interpret as the voice of Satan. But it's always dead baby's bones. Oh my. That was Satanism. Um, are you are, are you a Christian? Yeah, very much. That has what has gotten me through a lot of things. You know, Good. my belief that there is somebody watching over me and Good. whoever it might be. I don't know. Yes. But I did, guess you ever, my, did you ever consider Catholicism? Well, my ex-husband was a Catholic, and I used to go to masses with him. Yes. But that got a little bit hard for me. Was it the new mass or the old mass? Uh, new. Oh, a new, mean, yeah. Well, that it wasn't in Latin. Is that what you mean? Yes, that's right. Yeah. It, 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 well, that got me down too. I never went to it. But, oh no. <laughs> I, I always said the old mass and never said anything else. But the new mass would get me down anyway. But yeah. uh, I'll, I'll tell you, uh, without prolonging it too much, um, next time you're in prayer, ask our Lord Jesus to enlighten you to give you strength and guidance as he has up to this that was my question because how can i help myself to remember because i feel like well, i'm stuck I, I wouldn't be intent on remembering so much um i would be intent on um what i do now as regards the worship of jesus who is god and the cultivation of his angels and um seeking out some good priest, a good priest, and talking to him. And surely in Colorado, you must find somebody. Would they um, believe me, though? What? Would they believe me? If they're a good priest, they'll believe you and they'll know what I know from what you say. Because I have been to a couple of therapists and just mentioned this, you know, oh, about yeah. my past. Yeah. No, and... They, they, they tried to turn it into something else. It was like they didn't believe me. I know, they don't. Yeah. You, you, you know the difficulty is this. It's not therapy you need. It's healing. It does a big difference. Therapy consists of a, a mixture of conversation and logic and pharmacology. Mm -hmm. mm, yeah. Now that's therapy, but that, that merely makes you viable. <laughs> you know, you can carry on. <laughs> but it doesn't heal the soul. Only the grace of our Lord Jesus does that. You're does making that... me cry. <laughs> well, that's well, clear, though. <laughs> tears, tears are very, very salvific, darling. Uh -huh. Don't be afraid of them. 